Hello. How's it going? Tuka, how are you? Hope all is going well. Oh, I'm so excited to get back to this game. I had to take like a bit of a mental break because I've had so much going on between like fig and work and I'm just I'm just excited to get back to this. Also, I've got new mic settings. Uh, so if my mic sounds like super weird at any point, please let me know. It looks like it might be a little bit loud, maybe. I don't know. Let me know if there are any weird hiccups, because this is all new. But it sounded pretty nice when I was just messing with it off stream, so. Hopefully, if we get any surprise spooks, you'll actually get to hear me shit myself and not just imagine what it's like when the mic cuts out. I, I see no reason to delay loading up our save. Oh, that was weird. Oh, that was super weird. <laughs> My, uh, I was adjusting the, uh, the volume while I was tabbed out of the game, and then some somehow my mouse locked back onto the game and it moved everything. Uh, all right, well, let's wake up. Cool. All right, I'm seeing a little bit too high there. That, that looks better. Yeah, and if I get loud, okay. All right, cool. Uh, da, da, da. Ah, yes, home. Look at, look at all our little satellites going around and... Ah, ship. How I've missed you. Uh, we gotta go to the computer first. Okay, so remembering where we left off, we had just broken the matrix. Um, and so I think I know what I want to do next. I want to try to get into this third room, um, which will involve going past the fireplace, which is in the building where all the guys are uh, chanting. But I think what we have to do, this is just my, my current guess, is we have to go to that area, unlock the, the door from the one side. Oh, good. I'm so glad the auto lock is working. Um, unlock the door from one side and then actually wake up and go to a different entrance and then go back to that same location. That's my hunch. That's what I think we have to do. Um, but we'll see. Yeah, because we have to get that door open if we come from the other direction. But Tuka, how are you doing? Ah! Are the birdos doing well? Gucci, glad to hear. Uh, okay, all right. Where am I? Where's the entrance? There it is. Bird just got a small cage makeover. That's exciting. Are they loving it, or are they kind of doing their their bird scared of everything thing? Or hello. Oh, I learned a crazy toucan fact the other day. If anyone wants to redeem the bird fact channel point, I should lower the cost of that. I always want to talk about birds. Bird fact! Hell yeah. You know I'm there. <laughs> okay, okay. So, 
toucans have like super crazy diets where if they uh, eat too much iron, it, it'll it'll just like kill them. They they'll get iron disease, um, and that's uh, like a new thing to learn from the bird. Ha like uh, hus husbandry uh, thing is the iron deficiency. However, however, the issue becomes now that everyone is adjusting their toucan's diets because of to, to make sure that they're prioritizing low iron uh, fruits they're giving more of other fruits and toucans are now like the leading cause of death is like diabetes and this is like brand new no one knew that toco toucans get diabetes and now they're like all getting diabetes it's it's crazy I just learned about this the other day, uh, and I even, like, did some Googling afterwards, and I couldn't find, like, any information about it because it was so, uh, so, like, new. A toucan with an insulin pump? Oh. Oh. That's so sad. Yeah, you can treat them with insulin, actually. You just give it orally. All right. Also, Orc, how are you doing? Okay, so... We have to open the door behind us. Which... I think we can just do right here. Eh? Oh, extinguish. There we go. It was one of those. Uh, and then the other thing I wanted to do while I'm here, I don't think I have to do this, but I'm gonna do it anyways, is, uh, just set up the bridge. I thought it was that way. Oh, I guess it is this way. Ah, there we go. So we have to go around. I, I, the more I think about it, the more I'm like, I definitely don't need to do this. Bridge. <laughs> Where is he? If we, if we say bridge three times, does he show up? Okay. There we go. So let's just have that there. I don't think we even need it, but I'm just just for the ease of, of later. Bridge showed up yesterday and you fell off a bridge in Star Wars. It was fate. Oh, man. <laughs> that is funny. Uh, I get so lost in here. Oh wait, I just have to wake up. I don't even have to go back. <gasps> I didn't have to do any of this. All right. Done here. Now we're gonna leave. And we're gonna go to the next area. Yeah, there's a, uh, a thingy here. Ugh. Oh, oh my god, I almost didn't make it. But, Orc, how are you doing? Happy Tuesday. I think our raft is a little bugged. <laughs> Our raft was like, let's go white water rafting. Okay, so let's go to this one now and see if this does what I expect it to.
Do do I ever get a nostalgia kick listening to early 2000 pop songs? I mean, who doesn't, right? That is like the thing on TikTok right now, though. No lie. They're like, by the way, are you familiar with Avril Lavigne? And there's another one that was going around lately. I'm trying to... You can't scare me, spooky deer man. Oh, man, I'm trying to remember the artist that or the the that I saw on TikTok lately that has like started going viral all of a sudden out of nowhere just on this new trend. Didn't know Avril I was coming out with a new album until today. <laughs> I keep seeing like little things about it, yeah. Uh da, da, da. all right, we're going to go here. We're gonna call a boat, and we're just gonna circle all the way around until we get back to that other area. Ugh. I'm so glad that this is on rails. I don't have to worry about it going the wrong way. Also, I think this area is pretty clever when it because it's like a it's it's very clearly a, like a little loading stage, right? You can't see any of the walls or anything. One more area, one more area. Right? Yeah. One more. I heard that uh, the Life is Strange remaster is getting really bad press. I don't know if anybody has checked it out yet. It only came out a couple days ago. I'm, I'm hoping that whatever the issues are, are something that can just like be resolved in a couple of patches, you know, from feedback. I'm nervous. I heard it just doesn't look very good. Dave, hello, gonna be lurking. I hope that you have a great night, Dave. I'll see you around. Have a good lurk. Um, but yeah, I just, I just heard that, like, it didn't look very good and there were some bugs and stuff. Saw some side-by-side -side screenshots, it doesn't look like a remaster at all. Yeah, when I first saw it, like, a, a couple weeks ago, I was like, this looks pretty good for, like, the close-up stuff. But it seems like those were only pictures of the, the very main characters that I looked at, but a lot of the side characters didn't get nearly as much attention. And therefore, it's just not as good. What? They're not supposed to be here. What are you doing here, sir? I thought that if I came here now, you wouldn't be here. Because I never heard the music when I came from the other areas. I feel deceived. Deceived. What am I supposed to do now? I could leave my artifact. And we could go into the matrix and just see what's going on. Um. God, this is so cool. This will never get old. I love the music, too.
Where's the... Where's the thing? Where's the... Uh, fine, I'll go behind you. What's this? Oh. Oh, it's just like a dock or whatever. Alright, fine. Don't worry about me. I'm just... It's not scary. Everything's bright and blue. It's fine. It's just... The dam breaking. Alright, so how the hell do we do this area? That's the thing, right? That is the question. Oh, there's nobody here. Oh, but I can't go down without my light. Fuck. Alright. Well. At least I was kind of right. There's going to be a guy, like, right here. Uh, uh, uh. I don't... I don't know. I might make it. If, the, if no guy shows up, I might be okay. I might have time to come back. I had a hunch that was gonna happen, but I, I just thought that I would be less scared in the Matrix, which is true. Alright, let's go... Get my little light ball. My little lantern. What is nice is I don't see any guys now, but oh my god, it's gonna be so much harder to find what place that we have to go. Oh, that's not right. Oh, I'm gonna get so lost. Fuck. Just put it down. Take a couple steps away. Alright, where is... the door? Okay, so we have to go... further this way. I've never done this not following a guy. Sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that this is, uh, that we're lost. What did I fucking do? Oh my god, what the hell? It's gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine. I'm wasting so much time. Almost walked into the water. Alright, let's just find the... Am I crazy? Oh my god, it's right here! <laughs> Huh. All right. Okay, okay. It's funny, I was gonna be like, we're probably gonna finish this game tonight. And then I, like, 
you know, think about it for even a second. And, uh, I waste way too much time for that to be likely. Alright, um, if this is anything like all the other locations, this will be scary and we will get to properly test my mic settings. Does it have to make that noise? It mic sounds great! Love that. Uh, uh, okay. This one was way too easy compared to the other ones. Why is this the last one that I went to? All right, let's see. What were the slides that were deleted on this one? I think this one was less intuitive because of the, um, because of walking through the fire. Like, that seems like the least intuitive. And, like, when you are dropped off here, uh, you're just immediately met with enemies. So I just avoided it entirely. I was like, I'll do any other area before this one because of all the dudes. Okay, so he, he gets the power of the eye of the universe. Or he, he sees something about it. Everyone else comes and looks. They... Ooh. They destroy their home planet. To make this space station. And move it over. Okay. That was new. That they destroyed their home world to, to do this. Uh, I figured out how to get there with all the dudes dead, and then the room was dead. Tried walking in the fire because, uh, the fuck else was there to do in that room? Fair. Yeah, I guess once you've figured out that when you get there at a, from a different location, I think, that they're not all just standing there. <laughs> okay. So this was... When they're going through- Yeah, that was right! It's when they're loads in a level! <laughs> but when you- Ooh, should I try jumping off when we get into here? I guess that's the next thing to try, right? What happens if we jump off while a level is loading? Okay. That's pretty neat. It's burned. Figured as much. Um. Can I get far enough away from the artifact? I don't want to, like, send it up the elevator. That would be a little bit much, but... Okay. Alright, cool, I can. I can't go... Knob! Hello! How are you doing? Oh, that's cool. The slide reel looks crazy. Um... You're great. I'm glad to hear it. If there's anything exciting going on you want to share, feel free. Well, this was cool. I think we've learned what we can. Um, was it this? Oh, that made the thing light up and that's how we got over here. Got it. Okay. All right. Well, we saw this two slides here that we need. I think we're done. Just vibing? Hell yeah. Uh, so where do I want to go? Do I want to wake up? I think I do. I'm going to wake up. Good morning. Hey, everybody. 
Walter, hello. So what did we just learn just popping by? Yeah, we just learned that we can potentially, um, oh, sorry, so distracted. Actually, I want to go back down here. I'm not quite done here yet. Um, we just learned that you can jump off of the boat when it's in between loading levels. Um, so I'm going to try that next. We don't have a lot of time left in this loop. Um, the other thing that we learned is that the natives here, I gotta name them, because they don't have names. Owl, elk, pyro, thank you so much for the raid! Dragonflower, hello, how are you doing? Welcome in, welcome in. Let me get you a shout out. If anybody in chat right now isn't already following uh friendly pyro here please please do the needful they are very good people uh that and i need a new keyboard when i do control c most of the time it just doesn't work uh most people call them owl elks or owl elks you call them strangers i mean that works because it is the stranger that works also, hello, uh, is that Elijah? Is that how it's pronounced? Sorry if I, I, I'm super bad with names and words in general. Apologies in advance. Pyro, how is your stream? Painting some Warhammer minis? Eli. E oh god, that makes so much sense. I'm sorry. I'm I'm just <laughs> Cuz I'm the worst. All right. We're on the boat. We got on the boat. Off we go. All right, we're going to try this. Whoa, what? Most people mispronounce it. It doesn't seem like a super uncommon name, though, right? Where do I go? Couldn't use Eli. <laughs> Should we go down here? What are we... Where... Oh, no. Okay, never mind. Can't do that. <laughs> Did more building on your orc car? Hell yeah. I was doing a lot of knitting lately during your, uh, during your streams, Pyro. Lots of lurking and knitting. It's nice having those artist spaces to actually... Uh, just, just vibe. Just, just vibe and do art. Gotta run and do dinner. And uh, wind down. Hell yeah. No, take, please, take, uh, time you need to de-stress after a stream. Totally, totally get it. Have a great dinner. I will see you around. Thank you again for the raid. Really appreciate it. Giant, hello, welcome in. How are you doing? Bridge! Bridge, thank you so much for the resub. I thought it might have been an Irish spelling. <laughs> Bridge, how are you doing? Oh. Okay. Whew. Okay, okay. Let's go this way because it's at least no 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 what a cliffhanger fuck okay <laughs> all right all right all right all right all right 
how am I finding Echoes of the Eye? I'm loving it. <laughs> you knew that was gonna happen. You know, I suspected it, but I kind of forgot at the same time. I was like, I know there's not a lot of time left. But that's okay. Bit of work and lurk. I hope that work goes by fast for you, Bridge. That was at least a very productive, um, a very productive loop. But I am also just like, hurry up! Hurry up, get on the elevator! Get on the elevator, get, get back on the ship! Hit the autopilot! We gotta get back! We gotta do science! I feel like more should have been uncovered than just this. Uh, library full of intact I'm actually not gonna read this all aloud because I, I feel extremely confident that I learned everything correctly. <laughs> eh. No, why can't I lock onto it? Oh, come on. Whatever, it's fine. Some sort of... It happens sometimes when I boot the game, and not other times. Luckily, it kind of, like, hones in a little bit. Yeah. Good enough. Am I? Alright. Too bad there's no campfire work. Can't just sit, sit out to pass the time faster. Yeah, it's, it's funny. I was actually thinking, um the other day about Outer Wilds tattoos, which, like, it's, it's just very tempting, you know? Uh, I, I don't know if I'll actually, like, get one. There's a lot of tattoos I want, right? There's very few I actually get. But I love the idea of getting the first planet that you visited from the first, uh, or from the base game. I think would be really cool. Just like something small. Oh my god, come on. Up. Get it. Okay. Um. Like I think. Oh, no, no, but the artifact. Get, get back here. Oh shit, what have I done? Fuck. Ah, <laughs> oh, damn it. <laughs> get me out of here, get me out of here. Odins, thank you so much for the raid! What were you playing? You are playing Stardew? Is this your first time playing Stardew? Oh my gosh. Hookshot, welcome in. Hookshot, welcome in. Defy it, welcome in. How are you guys doing? Did you have a good stream? You played a bunch first time streaming it though. Oh cool. I started playing Stardew for the first time a couple weeks ago. Well, I guess it was a couple months ago at this point, but um, I can see why everybody loves it so much. Makes total sense to me now. Oh, right. Thank you for the reminder. Well, thanks for coming over to my channel. I appreciate it a lot. Did you have a good fig? I had a lot of fun. Yeah, for anyone who doesn't know, on Saturday, um, I was live streaming at an event called Boston Festival of Indie Games and just like going around and interviewing some wonderful folk. 
learning about new and upcoming games. It was a really good time. You did, but it was late for you. You're from Australia. Oh my god. Yeah. That... That is... The one downside of these, like, worldwide virtual events, right? Is that, like... They're... Not always in a friendly time zone. Also, I wonder if I'm doing this inefficiently. Like, should I be going to the cliffside um, entrance each time? Because that one technically has the longest amount of time in the loop? Or is it kind of a moot? difference? Like, does it not really matter? Not sure. Just got done watching uh, a Graveyard Keeper stream, which is kind of like a Stardew, except everything is screwed up uh, in a distinctly Slavic way, where it's fine, I guess. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I haven't done, like, any modding or anything with, uh, Stardew, but I can imagine it, it's a really fun one for that. Aw, oh, thanks, Bridge. I'm glad that you enjoyed Fig. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Yeah, if, um, um, Hook, if you want to plug your game, feel free to, uh, to put the name. I don't know if, um, links, links might be disabled because of all the, the goddamn bots, but if you want to plug the name of your game so people can look it up, feel free. Oh, right, I had to jump off. Ha! Huh, almost forgot. All right. Lightsmith. Yeah, so I'll- here, I can give you a little bit of a, a description there. Um, so with Lightsmith, it, it does have, like, crafting elements and such, but you're, you're like, creating light and, and moving light throughout the environment as, like, a resource. It's really cool. I'm very interested to check it out. There's, like, a, I've got, like, a big list of games that I want to play after Fig. Uh, extinguish. <gasps> oh, that's neat. Okay. Huh. Huh. Interesting. So, this one's just, like, off now. I'm just wondering if this is going to have any more information. I think it's just going to be the same thing. We all have a list of games. The Steam Shame Pile sounds about right. Um, so yeah, this just shows how to get into the secret room, I'm pretty sure. Oh, no. There we go. Okay. So we did that. We still can't get across here. We have to come from the other side. So do I just have to... How do I get to this one? Because this one's up on a platform. This one you can't just walk to. That one you can just walk to. What's the deal with this one? Also, one thing I really wanted to try, because I haven't... I don't think I've done this yet. Is let's put... Put the artifact down. We'll walk away from it. Okay. 
There's one more. Nope. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. But I need the... I need my thing now. Right. Of course. Of course. Makes sense. Makes sense. So now I just need to do this last one, which I haven't worked out yet. But yeah, I, a while ago, I don't know if any of you have uh, checked out the itch.io bundles. Like, once a year or so, they do um, these enormous, like, 500 or 1,000 game bundles for, uh, for, I think, I think you can pay whatever you want, even. Um... What? Uh, what? <gasps> Why'd I fall? Uh, but like, if you pay five dollars, it like goes towards a good cause. Like one year they did Black Lives Matter, another time they did, um, funds for Pakistan, and it was, it's always like a really good cause or some like natural disaster relief, stuff like that. And you get, like, more games than you'll ever play in a lifetime. Prettiest dang bridge I've ever seen. <laughs> Invisible bridge does not have guardrails, yeah. Bridge out, bridge out! Bridge, I really like the theme of your of your whole stream. Like I appreciate that that your stream has such a strong theme. Does that make sense? So, okay. We want to go over to this side now, I think. committed to the theme. I yeah, cuz like I've been kind of thinking that for my stream I think it's like I I want to develop my own theme more. So I've been like toying with the idea of commissioning like a starting soon screen or a BRB screen. Huh. Okay, so that didn't work. I don't think I can go to any of those buildings. Oh, it's so close. I just want to be right there. How do I get to you? But I've thought about, like, if I did get... Can I even get back from here? Can I call the... Boat? Come back! Come back! Sir! Uh... Okay. Well... That sucks. Um... I can't get back up either. I'm stuck here. That's fine. <gasps> um. 
yeah, with birds. Like, it'd be cool to have, like, an animated background or, or like, an anim- animated, like, maybe a living room or, or something, like, kind of loungy space or whatever. And then you've got, like, a bird on a perch and, like, the only thing animated in the image is the bird, like, preening or flapping its wings every now and again or something. I think that would be really cool. Um... So... Here's my thinking. Um... I think that I should go to the bell entrance. Get get out of the way. Get out of the way. Cozy bird vibes, yeah. Right? That sounds just up my alley. But I also don't, like, I don't know how much that would cost to get that, like, commissioned, right? I wish I knew how to do animation, because that's, like, something I would love to make for myself. Like, I, I really like making my own emotes and things, so it'd be cool if I could just, like, do it myself, but... It's, uh... Not that easy. Not that easy. And do I want to spend, like, 50 hours learning a whole new skill? Not, like, really. Maybe someday. Oh! Oh! Only one left! Only commissioned email art, so not sure how rough that would be. Yeah, I, th I guess, I think it just depends how intricate you want it. I have is my assumption, right? Like, if it's very simple, it could probably be something that's, like, 50 bucks. But if it's, like, got a bunch of animations, that'll just double it off the bat. Because it's a lot of work. All right. So, we got... Oh... I forgot I didn't have a jetpack. Um, how the fuck do we do this? Let me put this down again. And we'll come back to it. Okay. Trying to see if these do anything notably. I have an idea. Huh. I was hoping there was like a total eclipse one, because that would have been clever. Like maybe if they're all on total eclipse, then then the light will go out, right? But I think that's actually how it starts. So I have one code here, back from a previous, like, puzzle that we found. We could just try it. Oh. Nope. We could try going back up, because it almost seems like the light is coming- the, the light is coming from above, right? So, let's try something really quick. For my break screen, I um, actually reached out to an artist and asked if I could use their art uh, and put a link to their store page on the channel. Oh, nice. Okay. So, to me, it looks like the light is coming down from, like, here. And 
Oh, that's weird. I got like stuck on the start of the staircase there. Um. Is this the same? I'm gonna just die from walking around. Just seeing if there's any like weird hidden paths. Find some cool bird art and reach out to the artist. Yeah, maybe. I have to look around. Hmm. Okay. Maybe not, maybe not. I was hoping. This is the only one I haven't figured out. Okay, so we're back down here. I won't accidentally murder myself by jumping off the ledge. Hey, I'm gonna go to the other side. I'm gonna put this down and I'm gonna walk all the way over here. Because Yep, they can still see me. How do I put out this light? I know you don't have to make that sound, but you choose to anyways. Is that the... Is that the loop already? You joking? Uh. Huh. So, I always thought it was like this light or something or like the campfire light. Because it kind of looks like it. Kind of looks like that's the tower of light that's coming down, you know? Oh, I wonder... I wonder if there's a way that we can, like, raise this or something. And then... Pretty sure they make that sound when the dam puts out their fires. It's cool. Uh, okay, so maybe if we can get back up there, there's something new that we've learned that we can apply to that area. Um, that's my hope. I don't have too many other ideas. Oh, you don't have to make that sound. Oh, oh, oh. Um, yes. Yes, yes, yes. That makes sense. Sorry, I didn't realize what you were talking about. I thought you meant the, the music when, like, the loop happens. I was like, uh, okay.
Maybe I'm closer to finishing this game than I thought. <laughs> Just the sound of them actually dying. Aw, oh, rip. Sucks to... Must suck, I guess. Alright. I'm gonna figure this out. I'm gonna figure this out. <gasps> Session of food. Pyro, what'd you get? I'm, I'm kind of sad that the game is ending soon. Actually, like, very sad. I'm, I'm very sad that the game is ending soon. Vegan Mac! Nice. Have I really not fully explored here? Like... Or is that just a bug that's not getting rid of that icon? There we go, now it's doing it. Oh, I'm very tired. I, um, I binged a bunch of, uh, Squid Game. And, and got into that and oh man I recommend it it's very good but also it's heavy okay so Oh yeah, I didn't say. So the, I had another idea that I thought would just be like really cool. I don't know if I would want to get this because it would be much more intensive. But um, for another like Outer Wilds tattoo idea, I really liked the idea of getting like one of the elk elk deer, um, owl elk strangers. Um, holding holding one of the artifacts, or even just like a lantern, like as like a shoulder piece, have one of the guys kind of like. Hmm? I thought that just stylistically, it would look really cool. Um, so we'll go all the way around to the. To the bell, I think. I want to see if we can raise it up. Feel very focused. <laughs> I don't know what to say because I'm just like, okay, we gotta get there. We gotta get there. We're gonna we're gonna try experimenting with stuff. We're gonna see if it works. I know what else is kind of weird is I never found the the key. I don't know what to call it. The 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 thing with all the different codes. The locks with all the codes. Um, I never found the one that's on this surface level area. It could be over there, maybe? Because I don't think I've been over there in a really long time. Maybe we should go there next just to refresh ourselves. 
Still can't. We still don't know their language. It's gonna be, like, really cool, I expect, when we do finally get those translations. Alright, it's locked. It's fine. Uh, how did I get in here before? Did we go in from below? It's possible. In fact, we did. So, I want to know if we can... Raise it up. I guess not. Okay. Yeah, so that's the light that I need to turn off, right? Okay. So how do I do that? Oh, I hit the wrong button. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. So I guess we'll go across to the other side, because... That was less informative than I thought it would be. All the way over. Do 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 do. What is over here? Oh! Here it is! Here it is! Here it is! Hell yeah! We have this code! I have this code! Son! I can't believe that it took me this long to get back here. Was this the- I think that's the right one. And then, fire! And then we got this guy again, and then fire. Yeah! Oh, no, yeah! Ha-ha! Did it! What do we do? Oh, what do you mean? There's gotta be something in here, right? Alright, what's this? Ship log updated. Ugh! So this some kind of satellite and and the the wheel isn't working. Oh, that's kind of that's kind of cool. That it just pulled out my scout as I got close. I want to retrieve Scout. So where is this? Like, do I even need to get in here, though? This is the same code that I already have. Okay. So... Maybe it's unable to read data? 
Maybe that's the issue because like that's broken? Oh, this is just right here. Oh, maybe it's like if you didn't figure out the door code, you could... I see. There's another way to get that. You can put your scout in here, take the picture, and then you got the code. Got it. Okay. It was a clever tutorial game, but it missed its opportunity. was over here. Finding that code was like one of the very first things you did in the DLC when you got to this stranger. Well, coincidentally, coincidentally, it was one of the first things that I found that I looked at, right? Like, I did find that puzzle. Um, I just never found it again. I never came back here. Huh. All right, well. I really want to do something with the bell. I don't think it's like one of these other light beams. it be I don't think I can go down to the bell when it's submerged can I oh I guess I guess I can I thought it would be too deep I thought I had like tried to do this once and I just couldn't Okay. I know that I'd have to get the other ones too. Oh, that's fine. Mm, well, it's still there. Excuse me, game. I need a tutorial. Ow. Ow, how, how. Anything I put here would be guessing, I think. Unless I just try one of the other codes that I have. Mm, 
that's that code is actually too short anyways been here before yeah I have Like, wondering if there's anything else down here? Mentoring, hello. Just, just the Kraken. Uh... I wish I had my ship. Yeah, Pyro, unfortunately. No dice. Um, I figured out eventually, but let you know if I want to settle hint will do. Um, what could it be? So I tried going from the back and that didn't work. What else can I try? to think of like all the lessons that the game has taught me for extinguishing those those things you missed the last one so you have no idea no worries um So if I wake up here, I go back out. Come on. I've been wa watching someone else play during the same period. It made it tough to keep track of who knows what. Oh, yeah, I bet. Yeah, so I know that if you you have your light out, you can go past those those blinky guys, right? I, I know that. Um, yes, Pyro, we got down there and I almost like died of fright like IRL I almost just 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 uh, just right on the keyboard just dead uh it was horrifying absolutely terrifying <laughs> yeah it is so scary it was so scary oh I hated it <laughs> 
there's a couple really good clips. Um, so basically, to get down there, um, to get down there, you have to blow out all the lights in the whole area. Once you've done that, um, uh, once you've done that, they all go down and like start stalking the area as you're trying to uh trying to like navigate so i went there before i don't think i've gone here yeah so you have to like sneak around them but because of where they they stand you have to actually alert them and then redirect them. It was awful. Oh, wait, what? This is... Oh. This is... Aw, oh, man. Alright, whatever. It's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fucking fine. Did we get past everyone down there? Yes, we've been to all three libraries. I'm gonna figure this out. It was an even scarier path before the patch? Are you joking? Oh my god, I, I don't know. I was like, really struggling. I'll, like, there were a couple of times there where I didn't think I was gonna be able to keep playing this. Like, I, it was, it was so scary. Um. And like, I pushed through it and it was fine, but. I've gotten all three error reports from the DVD collections. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Sorry, I'm, I'm doing a poor job of explaining what I've seen and where I've been. Found a room with bird control interface. I wonder if we'd be able to go find that craft. The sealed vault. God damn it, game. Where should I go from here? So I'm trying to think of like what I should do next, right? Because I'm not sure how to get past those blinky dudes. I don't think brute forcing it is gonna work. I think I need another piece of information before I can do it. Unless I should take some time to read through all my logs. I can do that. can at least take a glance through them and see if there's anything around here that I missed. Um, but I don't even think there's an entry for that, like, pathway that's blocked. Starlight Cave. Endless Canyon. Um, um. Entered by swimming from below, there's a sealed vault 
illuminated by green fire inside the structure. Yeah, that like... Oh, there's a bunch of stuff here. Okay. That just shows there's a slide reel at each of these locations that talks about that thing. Ah, uh, man. Okay. If the ship explodes, do I die? <laughs> Think of the error reports. I remember there was the error report for walking off the bridge. Okay, why? Um, all right, I'm gonna figure this out. I'm gonna figure this out. Uh, let's see. I feel like we have to do this one first. It seems silly to do it when I, oh, I don't have the, God, Damn artifact. It's fine. It's fine. Don't miss this jump. Okay, it's fine. Everything's fine. We're just gonna go this way. <laughs> I can't believe I forgot it. I've been really good about not forgetting it. So, we'll just go to that location. We'll just enter from there. Nice music. Oh, I'm sorry I'm so quiet. I'm just like brainstorming, like constantly. Um, We'll grab our artifact. We have to go up first. Oh, faster. have to keep going up. My bad, my bad. I've played this game before. I know where things are. Give me this. Thank you. Oh, so much time. Okay. Where is it? Here it is.
Also, Paro, if I didn't say thank you for lurking. Thanks for lurking. Wake up. Alright, we're back here at... I don't know, maybe my least favorite <laughs> of the entrances. I did not like this one. This one sucked. But there is a rather convenient... I guess not that convenient compared to the other one, but I guess it's about the same. Whatever. Um, to go down there. Oh, I can't just go over there. Right? Oh, I thought I could. Oh, I don't want to do all that. I'm not. Why is my controller buzzing? No need for that. Alright, I guess I can't get down here as easily as I thought I could. Uh. <gasps> uh, nope. I'm good for right now. If I do need a hint, I will let you know, but thank you for asking. I know I'm so close to the end of the game, too, so if I, um, I, I wanna, I wanna figure it out. should probably just start the loop over, which also kind of stinks, because I've just spent so much time trying to get where I want to be. But, ugh. That also feels wasteful. Maybe I should just try experimenting down here one more time. I'm still annoyed that I can't raise this up because to me that feels like not even like that like a good solution, right? But it's broken. And I don't think we're supposed to like... Do anything up here. Because that would be unexpected, and that doesn't sound... If I was the game dev, I wouldn't put the solution up here. I would put the solution down there, either like in this house or under here somehow. That almost looks like one of the things that you extinguish through, almost.
I feel like the solution should be to, like, the, like, the code should be environmental. But there's nothing here that really signifies darkness, and also none of the other puzzles have really been like that. These ones we didn't even, like, get the code. Well, this one we got the code. You know what? I, I have an idea. Let's just put this down. And we'll go out of its radius. So... So we've got star, half circle, sorry if uh, this is a little dull for everybody, but we got star, we've got crescent moon, we've got waxing moon, we've got a little doohickey face thing, helmet face, and then we got another star. All right, good, I'm glad. Um, I doubt it'll be the same code, but I'm wondering like what if it's opposite or something. That didn't do it. What if it's like that? Nope. Would this be t way too easy? So it's not the opposite of that, it's not the same as that. Just trying to see if I can like see anything. Walk off, don't walk off the edge. <sighs> oh, it's so cool. I don't think we ever figured out what the code is for this one, actually. We just went over there and then. moved away with it. Okay. Uh, 
the heck? I wonder if there's like a third way to manipulate space time in the matrix that I don't know or I'm forgetting. Because you can get into the matrix by walking away from the thing. You can also get in the matrix by walking or by Oh, I have to I have to wake up, right? I was like, what am I where why can't I leave? Why can't I leave? Um, I could try going into the matrix while I'm in that area when you jump off in between levels. That's my next guess. Which I'm actually kind of surprised I haven't tried yet. You'd think I would have tried that, like, first case. Actually, you know what? I was gonna jump in the water, but let's give it to this guy. <laughs> Wake me up, sir. You get your chance. <gasps> Good morning. How do I extinguish you? Okay. It might not even be that light. <laughs> Is there a boat anywhere? There's one. There isn't even a lot of time left in this loop. Ah, I wish that the loops were longer. <laughs> I just need five more minutes. percent fuel remaining won't need that much longer all right go sleep Is the bell in this side? Which, uh, I haven't done very much there. I've explored it a couple times and didn't really find anything, but maybe it's time to go back there and see if there's anything at that under underground version of the bell. Maybe, maybe I should go there next. Which do I think is more likely? Is it better to jump down between levels or go to the bell? I think it's better to go to the bell first because then I can go to the other thing after. Um, not that there's a lot of time left anyways, but you know. Just thinking out loud. That's funny. I didn't realize it would just like make the thing. It's like, what's it gonna extinguish? I think, is this the second one or the first one? Damn, all right, that is the second one. Okay, 
All right, all right, all right. Let's restart. All right, that's fine. Okay. We'll try going to the bell first. We'll go to the bell first. Although I'm, I don't know. Man, I am, I am so torn because I remember going to the bell in Dream World, and there was literally nothing to do there. There was like a surprise vision that we got to look at. We'll give it a shot, though. That was a smoother landing than I expected. I'm also starting to wonder if I should really make it a habit to enter at a different entrance. Um, because we can more quickly go directly to the cliff entrance, um, which has the longest cycle. But this one I'm just used to, I guess. Also, the cliff entrance kind of sucks if you want to get down to where the boats are. Because you have to go and, like, light up the area and get through all the guys, and I'm not willing to do that. <laughs> I did it once! We don't need to do it again. No, thank you. shot it just a little bit games canceled for tonight oh i'm sorry pyro that sucks was it dnd because that's also the worst when dnd gets canceled one player isn't feeling well was willing to try another player's power went out oh it's the worst Well, I'm glad that we have you back, at least. Oh! Call of Cthulhu, another tabletop RPG. Nice. The only one I've ever played is D&D. &D. And with that, I still have a very limited amount of experience with it. But I'm, I'm starting to like... D and D a lot more. Um, the campaign that I'm currently doing has just been a ton of fun. I'm always looking forward to it.
All right, let's really, 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 really quickly see if the bell has any info for us. Great love of D&D are always down to try other TTRPG systems. Yeah, I'm just like, I feel so new to the genre that I just like don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> There was one room here that I don't know if I explored because I remember it was in the, the bottom area where the, the door is when you're going to go across across the thing. Um, but there was like a guy standing at the bottom and he couldn't see me and I just avoided him and I'm wondering if you have to get by him somehow. Probably not, but curious. Okay, here we are. We are back here. Is there a way that we can extinguish all these lights, perhaps? Maybe I should try leaving this here. So I am like 99% certain that I've been here before in the Matrix and couldn't do anything. Because here there's the look. I didn't notice that before. All right, I want I want my I want my thing back. Great love of Dean. Yeah, um except maybe Pathfinder. That one has always struck you as a bit of a rip off. <laughs> Fair. Very exploitable leveling system. Huh. It's interesting. So if I'm holding this light, does that change anything for those things that I just looked in, those windows? I wonder if I can also, like, get to these on the other side? I feel like I'm so close, you know? I feel like I'm very close to the answer. Um, I actually, I am gonna wake up. Wake up. March our way back up. And we're actually gonna leave. We're gonna go over to the bell. I wanna see if I can get to those normal windows on dayside time. Because imagine if I can just, like, put out the campfire somehow. I don't know how I would do that, but maybe I can.
Um, because of the light that's blocking the bridge. Might as well dock. So let's see, are those windows anywhere here? Oh, I don't even see them. Okay, well, we'll, uh, we'll go to idea number two. We'll try idea number two next. And idea number two is that we go back to the um, back to the asleep boats, boats in Dream World, jump off the edge, and then we leave our artifact somewhere. Not sure where, but leave our artifact somewhere um, in that like back end area. What timing? Oh, shit! Hey, you know what? I made it through alive and that's what counts. Alright. Come here, boat. I need you now. We know we've got like about 10 minutes ish. It uh, should be here. Let's get the boat. Oh, 
And we'll try jumping off again. I wonder if we should try jumping off at a different area. I'm actually going to try jumping off at the second one just to see if it puts us off at a slightly different location. I doubt it, but just in case. Gotta try different stuff, right? Yeah, I think it puts us off at the exact same location. Okay, so I'm gonna try to leave my artifact here and then just walk away from it, see what happens. Who knows, maybe a whole bunch of bridges will just light up all over the place. Yeah, I didn't really think so. I think that these are each of the libraries when I'm really looking at it. Yeah, I think that's what these are. These are each of the libraries. looks pretty cool. Yeah, that's one of the libraries. Okay. Well, now I know. I suspected, but now I've confirmed. So, to get over to this thing... Yeah, right, Pyro? It's... the game has changed a lot. So I can't jump down there. That's where I want to be. I can't quite reach it. So that's where the bell is. So I don't know where this light is coming from. If it's not coming from the bell. Um... It just... that's what makes the most sense. There's also this big, like, hole back here, which I don't know if that's intentional or not. But now I kind of just want to look at it. Oh, I think it's just the map. I think it's just the map is a little broken there. Uh, in the Matrix, yes. Able to see this? Unclear. Probably not. I think that's a bug. We're just going on a little tour, y'all. Just going on a little leisurely stroll around the pond. So, hmm. I wish I could remember what I got on the slide reels on on this building. Which, was that the first one that I went to or the second one? I think this was the first one. I'm gonna have to look at my ship. Well, the ship's log, like, are not... They don't show enough, in my opinion. I think they should show more on the ship's log. Um, or just let me go back there from here. That would be nice. Because I think you can get to one of them, but not all of them.
you remember going on a very sim similar leisurely stroll when you played this. That does make me feel better. Thank you. Because, good lord. Uh, no, I don't want to go down. I kind of want to actually just, like, go back over here. Oh, come on. I will figure this out. I will... I will figure this out. Oh, gosh. I feel so silly for being, like, so close. I'm so close. Let's let's check the ship's logs again. I want to verify some things. I want to remember what was so one of the reels was showing how to break the matrix, showing us how to get into the matrix. Another reel showed us how to jump off and then I remember that there was another one that was just showing like lore about them destroying their planet. But there must have been another mechanical one, another system one. That I'm just not remembering. So let's look at this really quick. Something's lighting up for, for, like, new. Oh, I was just looking at the wrong thing. Okay. So, Forbidden Archive. I think it was this Forbidden Archive. Okay, so that's walking beyond the radius. We we know that. This one. Alarm bell failing to wake up one of the stranger's inhabitants. Why? Do we have to go back here? No, this is the worst one. It fails to wake up one of the inhabitants. So how do we keep ourselves from waking up? Fuck. My controller keeps coming desynced. Do I have to go back to this archive? Because I don't want to. Describe the video in more detail. There's an important detail left out of the log there. If it's I, I just, I wish that they put the reels, once you've seen them, in the log. That would be nice. Because this is what I'm missing, right? Is, is, it shows an alarm bell failing to wake up one of the stranger's inhabitants. But I don't remember how. Um, Read all of it. That is solid advice. Okay, let's start from the top. A library full of in-text slide reels hidden deep underground. There's a container marked with one uh, one of the seal files was container. Its con contents have been destroyed. Found a slide reel that shows the strangers and inhabitants analyzing the eye of the universe. In-text slides reveal the construction and launch of a spacecraft designed to block the eye's signal. I found a slide reel that shows two artifacts being lit near a green fire. The first artifact lights after its bearer falls asleep. The second artifact after its bearer dies.
Oh. Two, two artifacts being lit near a green fire. Bring two artifacts? Yeah, I'm wondering that, but I'm also wondering, like, it lights when I die. I can- there- there are co conveniently two artifacts. There are conveniently two artifacts in that first area that we go to to get the first artifact. So... If we're holding one and we fall asleep, it'll light. It Maybe if we're holding one and we just, like, hurl ourselves off a cliff... But that doesn't sound right either. I feel like we'd have to die in that room, right? Still think the slide reel itself makes it a lot clearer. Yeah, I think it I, I imagine that it absolutely does. I just I don't want to go down there again. <laughs> so I'm like, I wonder if we could just jump across somehow. I don't think so, but maybe it's worth trying. Like I don't want Yeah, I wonder that too, Pyro, but I also feel like if you're not holding it, it's not going to do anything. And if, uh... Oh, man, I can just watch the slide reel. Thank you. I do want to just watch the slide reel again. Hold, please. This isn't cheating because I've been there before. All right. Hi, everybody. Here's YouTube. So the bell wakes you up. Surprise. So So this guy's asleep and this guy's just dead. Oops, okay. 
so... But how do I die? Like, that sounds crazy. <laughs> that doesn't seem- oh wait, shit, 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 shit. I need the thing. Thank you for the lurk. Alright, we got our artifact. boat. Alright, let's go back down to the... The only way I've died in Dream World is getting stepped on by the deer people. Yeah, I can only carry one artifact at a time, Pyro. Um... Let's go to the that ah uh, fuck. I all right. I don't need to worry about the other areas right now. I just need to figure out this one bridge. Um. So I don't need to hyper focus on the other stuff right now. Um. It's a shame I can't just like take my suit off and suffocate. That would that would be very convenient for once. All right, let's see. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it is, KY. I was thinking about that earlier, too. Okay, so I don't want to doze off. I want to... die somehow. Um... Maybe if I... Uh, if, I if I die while I'm asleep, I just wake up. Like, like, I can do that, and then just do that again, until I die. <laughs> that was a pretty convenient, just roundabout path. <laughs> Uh, 
Oh, come on. This is... This is so dark. <laughs> Just taking damage over and over again. Uh... Oh, come on. Am I just regenning? I didn't even- I didn't think that you did that in this game, but... Ah, uh, that sucks. Alright. I thought that this- the- oh, I guess because it's not suit damage, right? Up. <gasps> wanna put it on makeup? <sighs> Wondering if I'll be able to also like jump down. Ah, uh, no, that doesn't make sense either. Fuck! <laughs> what the hell? Oh, wait! Hold up. Oh, what if I just fucking cook myself? <laughs> Yes! Uh, <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Roasted! Welcome in! Hi! <laughs> Interestingly, I jumped uh, in the fire for fun. I first played this, that's how I discovered the dream world. Really? Oh my god. KY, I'm so excited to watch your playthrough. Because it's it sounds so drastically different from mine. Um, I'm also realizing that we won't- Okay, I just want to make sure this works. And then we'll restart the loop, and then we should be able to do all the doors. But we do have to do them in a specific order. We can't do the middle one from this location. I don't believe. So, I can just walk across now, right? Oh, weird. You don't even hear it. Oh, that's so freaky. Oh my god, I wish that I could just go around from here. Oh, I'm so, I'm so excited. Okay. All right, let's just let's restart the loop. Restart the loop, we'll do the middle one first, and then we'll do the others. We got this, we got this. Oh, finally. Finally, finally. Oh, I'm so glad I figured it out. I was like, hold on, there's a big fucking campfire. We can just roast our butts on it for 30 seconds. Wake up. Hurry up. Imagine everything you could have done if you'd spent time ex um, you've been exploring dead. Yeah. So I'm also, I'm very confused about how this plays into the base game of Outer Wilds, you know? Because if we die, then we can't stop the loop. We can't do the actual original game anymore if you're dead.
I do wish I had come up with a clever name for the... For the elk people. Ah, let me out. Um... We're not going to the bell first, it doesn't matter. Sorry that I'm taking the long way every time, but... Owl elks. Yeah, I know that's what people call them. Um, but I kind of want to, like, come up with my own name for them and, like, I don't know. Bird brains. They've got little bird heads. Yeah, you said strangers. I like that, too. Though I spent a lot of the time early game. Um I'm like sat under the dream world, someone's pulled they could just doze off, so I started doing that before encountering the first bell trap. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, you really you really explored this game completely out of order, huh? It wasn't annoying other other than the back. Yeah, yeah, I, I meant the back seating, yeah. That is pretty funny though. Oh yeah. If you were dead when you first encountered one, that would have, like, totally changed the game for you. Yeah, that's true, Pyro. I hadn't really thought of that. I, I just... Always was thinking about when their light goes out, they die, right? Because we we watch them perish. Okay. Yeah, subtle hint. For sure. Okay, we're gonna drop down. Uh, I think he, I think he just means that if you don't know what the bell towers do because you've only been there when you're dead, uh, it's confusing to just, like, kind of solve the puzzle, I guess. Oh, uh, because I, um, am gonna have to wake back up. Or I guess I can... ...do the whole thing. No, you're, you're right. You're right. Well, this is up now, so I can just jump in and wake up and then die. Um, huh? The only other reason, I think, would be to go to the bell directly. Because I'll have more time there. If that matters. I don't know if it matters. Um... I'm gonna try this first, I think. I'm gonna try this first with dozing off. Maybe it's redundant, because we're gonna have to move, but I think that's okay. It is possible that I'm just wasting a ton of time, but you know what, uh, it's fine, I'm not in a rush. We're not trying to speed this game along or anything. We're trying to prolong it, if anything. I will be very sad when it's over. All right, 
right, so we're gonna go here. Jumping down. Yeah, it's not like it recycles on a timer. Nah. Got all the time in the world. I am really excited to start the next game, though. I will say. I want to, um... Uh, extinguish. Yeah, because I guess you can just take this across and then you just do all the other puzzles. You just have to start over here, so it doesn't super duper matter, but... <gasps> we'll just, um... Wake up, and now we'll go to the bell so that we'll have extra time. And the, uh... The thing won't fall with the dam. Does it matter? I don't know, probably... This is probably taking way more time, but... We won't do it on the next one. Won't do it on the next attempt. I can't imagine figuring out dying to get into the dream world before just dozing off. Well, actually, it's not that actually it's not that far fetched now that I'm really thinking about it. Because when I was first trying to use the artifact in that room, I kept trying to light it on the fire and I kept burning myself. So I guess it's not that surprising. Exactly what you did. Gotcha, yeah. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it, we're gonna do it. We're gonna get all three areas. We got this, we got this. Alright, ready? Human barbecue. Ah, oh, shit, I jumped off it. There it goes. <gasps> nice. Do we know what the goal is for the DLC? You know, I haven't really figured that part out. Um, I'm sure there is one. <laughs> But, uh... Yeah, the base game is to stop the loop. I, I think this one, it's maybe to figure out what the eye of the universe is tr is communicating. Like, what's the eye's signal about? Um, like, what made these people uproot and just, like, destroy their home planet? Um, so I actually wrote down the code for this. Now we find out how good my note taking is. My note taking is decent. <sighs> Love that. Don't walk off the edge. Do not walk off the edge. We will just be dead. Part of me wants to wake up now, try like try jumping in the water, put our light out, do we just die? I mean, I'm sure we just die. <laughs> My god, I, we did it! We got all the way across! <sighs> oh, am I gonna freak out? Oh, is this gonna be real scary? Oh... Let's make sure all our candles are lit. <laughs> oh, I'm afraid. Oh. 
Oh, I hate this. Oh, I hate it. Oh, no. Oh, I'm not. I am not about this. This is the worst I've ever seen. Oh, God. Oh, it goes down. What the fuck? Whose idea was this? Where are we going? Oh, there's light. Light is safety, right? Oh shit, it's the- th it's the thing that they looked at the eye with! Sir? Boss fight, don't do that to me. <gasps> what the fuck? Are you friendly? Are you the first friendly one we've found? What do, what do we do? Talk. Oh, talk to him. Uh, Alright, good start. Good start. Okay, let's talk. Talk to the prisoner. The prisoner? Who are you? Yeah, teach me things. So they were containing the Eye of the Universe, and he released it. And then they all freaked out, put him in prison. In a really elaborate prison. went back to sealing it. <laughs> Already holding artifact.
Oh, I'm showing us. Maybe? This is so cool. I can't imagine doing this DLC before the rest of the game accidentally and then having the entire base game spoiled for you. <laughs> and yeah, I, I think I was trying to point it at him. I think I just didn't hold it for quite long enough. contains details you know yeah but there was a lot there that you only find from exploring the environment right so like especially the bit with the uh um but especially the part with the, um, the, the comet. Oh, sir. You can't just leave me in here. Sir. Sir. Excuse me. came all the way down. You, we could have gone up together. Oh, oh. Phew. That would have been such a dick move. Can you imagine <laughs> if he didn't send it back down? Where's our guy going? All our lights went out. supposed to ride off into the sunset together if I'm dead? Hold up. Let's, let's just... 
What? Uh, oh, okay, good. I was like, why can't I change directions on the... I'm just... Break of a dime. I beat the DLC. Is that it? Really? Do I get... I should get credits now, right? I shouldn't get a loop reset because I'm dead. I'm confused. There was also a different dialogue option that I didn't do. But I kind of want to go and see what the other thing that he was going to say was. Maybe it just equates to the, uh, to the same thing and it's not worth doing. Do the main ending? Yeah, but I, you know what I mean. You, you know what I mean. Shows the same thing. Oh, he does. Okay. So it would show the same thing. All right. Met one of the strangest inhabitants who is imprisoned within the vault. Gotcha. Okay. All right. Then I then I won't go do that again. I will go uh, down because I'm just gonna sit at the campfire for like six minutes. For doing the main ending, might as well be efficient. Yeah, so I'm using the, the tablets, yeah. Makes sense. Huh. I guess I, I know that I'm just surprised that there wasn't is that that's probably not enough time whatever I know we got that prisoner out is he gonna be like at the ending now he's gonna be like one of the people there during the send-off um I don't want to go to the stranger Autopilot, don't kill me. I didn't wait nearly long enough. It's okay. Here's where I want to be, at least. Don't get swept up by the sand. Oh, I'm like, I'm sad that it's almost over. It was so good. It felt too short. I wish there was more. I, I'd say the one thing that I felt was like actually kind of like missing from the DLC was some of the sense of scale of like going to different planets and stuff. Like, I don't know if there was an opportunity to like check out the satellite that that we stopped or that the, that the prisoner stopped the communication from, but
skipped a third of the entire DLC because I never solved that hidden passage. Yeah, I... I don't know. It, it did feel a little short to me. But that's just me. I think I just, you know, loved the game, so I want more of it. I think I found everything, but most of it doesn't make sense until you have the full picture. Yeah, but it was also- that was kind of the same way with the base game, right? Alright. I'm ready for the sand. Yeah, I will say I was very happy when the um, the game opened up with the with the Matrix. If it hadn't done that, I would have thought that it was like way too small. But Broken satellite, prisoner used it, and the others broke it. Oh, it was the prisoner's home. I thought it was a church. <laughs> oh, it's like totally just like a weird church. Give me that warp core. Ow! <laughs> ah! I didn't mean to... Uh, heal. And then, oh gosh, I have to get back to the vessel. Let's ping it. I did this so inefficiently the first time that I played. one of the dream entrance buildings, there's exactly one missing stranger. It must have been the prisoner's spot. Oh, That's so sad. Man. This poor guy. Although I don't really know what... I, I feel... I'm still a little bit confused about what... Why they were trying to block the eye of the universe. Like, was it... Did it have to do with the loop somehow? I kind of doubt it. Oh, too fast, too fast, too fast. Oh, fuck. Oh, damn it. They thought the eye was gonna kill them all. Um. I can fix the artificial gravity, at least. If I can figure out where the heck I am.
don't remember which one we're supposed to go to. I'm just gonna go with this one. Oh, okay. Got it. Don't eat me! Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Love the, love the three slightly different takes. Yeah. Like it's open to interpretation a little bit. I'm gonna have to just like stew on it for a little bit. Just gonna go a little bit further before I use my jets. Yeah, yeah, Pyro, the, uh, the angler fish are something else. Tell me I fucked this up. Yeah, I didn't fuck it up. Oh, that was really close. <laughs> I I hate this area. It's the worst. It's not okay, it's not as bad as uh, parts of the DLC, I'll say that. Uh, wait, but uh, uh, I'm sorry, excuse me, I'm, I'm sorry. I just said, go up, go up, go up. <laughs> Oh man, Pyro, you should do a free trial of Game Pass on PC because at least the base game is on, um, on PC. It's, no, it's, hold up. That, that, that. That, 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 that. had to move the uh the little ball thingy first and then i punch it oh. and here we are should we watch the sun explode i kind of want to just go down Nine hundred and fifty-ish combination for those coordinates. Oh my lord. Um. Yeah, don't bring this over. Point out something neat to look at. Sure. Yeah, bring it at. Bring it at me. 
either that or their universe is really small. See, can we get the uh, quantum moon to show up? Um, out there in the stars, see if you can find one that's moving. Find one that's moving. Oh! Is that the stranger? Oh, cool! Looked at it on the left? Wait. That's not- wait. That's something unrelated? On the left. I should- oh, it's just a supernova? I thought it was a stranger. What- where is it? Might have to leave the vessel now to see it. Go closer to the window now. It's out of view. That little guy? This one? What is it? My signal scope? How do I fucking... How do I actually use the signal scope? Is it... I never did that. There, there we go. What is it? Is that... Is that the stranger? It must be, right? It's gotta be. Oh, it's the satellite! Oh, neat! Oh, that's cool. Oh, that's cool. Thanks for- thanks for helping me find it. <laughs> That's cool, what a neat touch. All right, let's 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 plow through this ending, shall we? I don't know if anywhere in this game is safe. This is definitely not safe, but... Yeah, as long as it's not scary. As long as there's no... As long as there's no birds or anglerfish, we're good. Almost there. I still don't understand how we were able to do the loop. Like, after we died, I feel like we should have just get in, like gotten some goof credits. You know? Like in the base game if you die. And like actually die. get up here before so I, I don't think I actually want to go in there How 
I'm pretty sure there was like a ramp. I guess you're right. No, I guess you're I guess you're right, KY, because yeah, if you did when you yeah. No, you're right. I don't know why I was just getting my brain tied on that one. I guess because you're not interfering with the loop at all. Uh, my brain fart is strong. How the hell do I get up on this? Okay. Can I just go in and then jump? There we go. Haha, got it. Just had to re-remember how this works. Seeing if anything's different. Got our little satellite there. How could I not look around during the- what? What's like there- there's not much there. <laughs> I did, yes, I did mentoring. Yeah, I loved that. Static noise is bothering you. It'll be over soon. Oh, it's the signal scope. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. That was totally my fault. I thought it was just a sound effect. My bad, my bad. Yeah, sorry, Pyro. <laughs> I didn't realize that was the signal scope. Okay, um, here we are. Let's find our friends. around and they'll show up. Where is it?
Hey, man. Do you hear music? Time to grab the marshmallows. Wish I had some. It'd be nice. Right back. Not quite time yet. Let's go get him. E. I think not friend. That sounds new. Where is it? Up? How do we get him? Yeah, I can't interact with anything. Yeah, except the lights are on now, so I'd think that... Oh. Oh, shit. Yeah, it does do other things, huh? Aww. Is it lighting all of them? It 
it's so freaky. Oh. I think it's showing new pictures after you turn those off. What are you doing all the way back here? When my kind found the eye and realized what it was capable of, they were terrified. It was difficult. It was a. Di it was too difficult a truth, like a light too bright to look di upon directly. It burned them. What they could not unlearn was hidden away in darkness. Um. Uh. Ob obfuscated, obfuscated, then lost. They did not want to see their story end. My kind weren't always like this. We weren't always so afraid. I did what I could to set things right. Yet I am still of my kind and you know, um, and you know now what they did. I cannot promise our fears won't stay in your mind. And so, a choice. Are you certain you want to remember me? Heh <laughs> Join us. Let's see what happens. I'm not ready to decide. I haven't... Not sure yet. Hmm. Join us. I don't want to, uh, to repeat my kind, my kind's mistakes, but if you're willing to take that risk, then so am I. It's too late now. Yeah. Sorry. Well, I did look at three different pictures. Or you, you're saying that, like, one of them changes? Oh, what, eh, whatever. That's okay. I can look it up at some point. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, no worries. It's okay. It is okay if I do not see everything. There we go. Ah! <laughs> We got him. I'm excited to hear what this new version of the song is gonna be. Uh, oh, no, don't go up, don't go up, don't go up, don't go up. That one took me so long to figure out the first time that I played. I think I actually, I that I think that was the only thing that like I didn't figure out and I needed help with because I'd never used the signal scope like that before. Where'd it go? Anyway, we have to go up. There it is. Yep, 
Yeah, Pyro, it definitely is. And it makes a ton more sense once you're, like, when you've played the, the full base game, too. At least you know, like, what everything is. I think that's everybody. Do we have everybody? I hadn't dared to hope that anyone would hear the signal for how briefly I set it free, yet here we are. Are you ready for the final step? Yep. Then it's time. Time to send our spark out into the darkness. Aw, it's like a little cello. Let's start. Sounds like a theremin. It does, yeah. Aww. Nice yellow marshmallow. Oh. Uh, I just got achievement carcinogens. Am I missing Ryback? Am I? Oh yeah, I guess he's not playing. Sir. Yeah, that was missing. <laughs> the final piece. that out there. What a good game. Oh yeah, Pyro, no worries. Yeah, I definitely recommend checking it out. For sure. That was cool. I like that they tied in the DLC into the ending there. I guess I, I was expecting the DLC to have its own ending associated with it. Or like, I don't know, some kind of requirement, like you have to go and like recontain the eye or, or, or something to prevent the, the end of the universe. I don't know. We did it! We did it! I liked it a lot. I thought it was really cool. I'm really glad that I played it. I just wish I had more of it, you know? I hope they make another game 
like this, or in a similar kind of just scale and wonder. too much really to say about it like I just really enjoyed it I really enjoyed the DLC I think at some points it was a little bit too scary um, I I understand a little bit better why the the elk people were trying to kill us right they didn't want us to learn the secrets of the eye so that we would potentially like release the eyes signal but didn't seem like it really mattered anyways yeah really good game I'm gonna have the song stuck in my head forever. But yeah, thanks all for coming along with me and checking out this really cool game. Um, I'm gonna be playing Death's Door next. I'm gonna be starting that in the next day or two. Yeah, of course. Um, but I'm really looking forward to playing Death's Door and I, um, I know that's a relatively short game, so I, I don't think it'll take too long. Oh, well, thanks for tuning in. I'm glad that you enjoyed it. I know that, like, watching people play games like this can be, like, really fun, but also really infuriating, especially when they're, like, stuck on one puzzle for two and a half hours, you know? But, um, but we got there. Yeah. Yeah, I really, I, I love playing these games. I, I These are some of my favorite games to stream, too, just because I, I love the the wonder and that that sense of discovery and, and sharing that with y'all, especially Pyro, because you were experiencing it for the first time as well. So that was really fun to, like, bounce ideas off you while we were both kind of learning. What? What a cool game. If only they would make merch. <laughs> All right, they released a new DLC. Now they have to release new merch. That's the deal, right? They can't sell new DLC and not sell t-shirts. I didn't catch that. They, it may have, I didn't catch it. At least one Echoes t-shirt uh, that you managed to get, but it was sold out within minutes. Yeah, I'm not surprised. I want, like, an art book, like a developer's art book. Ooh, that looks new. <gasps> That's cool. Oh, that was really cool.
But yeah, like some kind of making up book. Like I know that there's the documentary that that they made on this that was really, really cool. And and I think like a, an art book or something would go hand in hand with this game. No question. Cool. Well, thank you for the GG's, everybody. Um, let's... Let me see. We'll definitely drop a raid. 